welcome to my channel. So today I am going to be bringing you a little mini haul um, from shopmissa.com. If you guys don't know what shopmissa.com, it is a store. Um, they have makeup products, jewelry, accessories, like, you know, as in like socks and headbands. So it's kind of like accessories. So jewelry, makeup, accessories, makeup tools, makeup bags. Um, I mean, they have like a plethora of the garbage man's outside. I'm sorry. <laughs> they have a plethora of just stuff. And the amazing thing about this site is that everything, everything on their site is a one dollar. Let me not even put up two because you guys might get confused and think it's two dollars. No. Everything on the site is $1. Only thing that you're not going to find on the site that's a dollar is more like bulk. Not even bulk. Just bundle things. So they have like brush sets that will probably run you about $10. But you're getting multiple brushes. I think you get like 10 brushes for $10. And it's just more so in a set, you know, so that you're getting all of them. So that's the only things that's not really like a dollar. Um, so I ordered a few things so that I could just test this site out. If you guys are interested in this look that I'm wearing, I'm using actually a lot of the products that I got. So my face is pretty much like a dollar right now. Um, so yeah, if you guys are interested, I'll be sure to leave that video down below for you all. But I'm just going to go ahead and jump right into everything I got from this site. Before I start that though, I did want to say that, um, let me show you guys this, because if you spent, I think, $20, you got this kit for free, so I think I spent a little over $20 um, with this order, and so I got this free contour kit, it includes six contour colors. Um, in a tin case with a mirror, so it's really, you know, contour and highlighting pretty much palette together. Um, it comes in like this really nice dual, I'd say, packaging. Um, and it's Makeover Essentials Contour Kit. Oops. Um, and it has like a little picture of, you know, when they give you an example of contouring. And then there's the palette. So you guys see that it's not used. Um, I'm not going to use it because it is going to be part of my giveaway. So this will be included in my giveaway. I just wanted to kind of show you guys, you know, like a little incentive to let you know that there will be a giveaway um, once I reach 500 subscribers. So I could have easily used this. Like even, um, to me, it's not like a deep contour kit. But I could have even used, like, you know, just the lighter shades to set something or anything like that. Or if I just wanted to bronze up one day, um, anything like that. But I want to use this as one of my giveaway prizes to go in a basket for one of my lucky 500 subscribers whenever I hit that amount. So, yeah, I'm going to just put this over to the side and see save it until that lucky day I hit 500 subbies. So I'm going to just go ahead and jump right into everything that I got. So let's start off. And some of these things I did just use because like I told you guys I just did this look. So I got this uh, little silicone sponge because I see people using um, these silicone sponges. Me personally, I didn't like it. Um, and I don't think it had anything to do with the fact that it was a dollar. I just think, I don't know. I didn't like the, the feeling of it, really. Um, so, yeah. I got this silicone sponge. And, of course, it was a dollar. And it is the brand AOA. So, they have different brands on their sites. But I'll be sure to be leaving everything down in the description as well as the link of the site. So that you guys can see everything. So, yeah. I got this silicone sponge. Then I got these two foundations that were both a dollar. I mixed both of these on my face today and then I used the mocha shade which is lighter than it looks on the site and in the bottle. Um, and then this espresso is two because when I first like seen espresso I was like 
hmm, that may be too dark. That's why I got both of these. Um, but together, I mean, I think they came out to my shade. So yeah, I used these two together on my face today. And then I used mocha under my eyes, down the bridge of my nose, my forehead, and my chin, and, you know, under my contour just to highlight because I did not purchase a highlighter from them. So, yeah, these two were both a dollar, and they're the Pro Contour Matte Finish Foundation. Um, if I had to say they were a matte finish, I think once, like, my setting spray and everything has set into my face, like, I mean, it's okay. Um, but at first when I was, you know, before I said everything, my face did look a little just like shiny. So I don't know all the way about matte, but for a dollar, I think these are a great foundation. And then next, I got this AOA Studio again, um, Wonder Skin Poreless Primer and it's clear. Um, I wasn't really a fan of this primer. I thought it was going to be really, really silicone-y. Like, if you look at the bottle, it looks like it's going to be silicone-y, but it was actually really watery. Like, I just felt like it was kind of, like, sliding, you know, across my face, which, of course, for a primer, that brings concern on if your foundation's going to slide throughout the day because you want a primer that's more me at least. I like a primer that's more like silicone-y and sticky because I feel like my foundation just sticks to it. Rather, when it's wet and kind of like slidey, I feel like my foundation is going to go where the wind goes. <laughs> so, yeah, this is the Wonder Skin Poreless Primer. And then I picked up this Pro Bronze um, Bronzer and contour which for you guys you know for me I'm a darker skin tone so this really is like a blush for me um I put a lot on my brush because I didn't know how pigmented it was going to be and this was actually a really pigmented um bronzer so yeah I would definitely say you know go a little easy go a little easy when dipping your brush into this um, I'm trying to just pick up the stuff I actually used on my face because it's kind of out. Oh, I got this LA Colors uh, Jumbo Eye Pencil in probably the shade Milk. Is it white or Seashells? It's actually in the shade she Seashells. And so I used this as a base on my eyeshadow, and honestly, it worked just as well as my NYX Jumbo Eye Pencil. So, I mean, you're saving like $4, so yeah. This was definitely a winner um, in my book. Hmm. I'm trying to get all the makeup out the way. I did pick up one brush. Um, I don't know if I'm going to end up using that brush or maybe putting it in my giveaway box, but I'm probably just going to get more brushes so I can add a lot to my giveaway, not just one random brush. Um, but I just got this flat angled brush. Um, I feel like you can never have enough of these at least for me I love using these for like my brows um also if you have like a gel liner these will be great so I feel like you can never have enough regular angle brushes and this is the E114 and it is also AOA Studio so then I picked up these three lip pencils. At least I thought I had three. Oh, actually I just got two lip pencils. This is one I actually used. So I used this one today on my lips. Um, Not that much pigment, but I mean for a dollar you really can't mess up with it. I mean you can always like use it for a track for when you're um doing a cut crease anything like that. So I got these two in the shades Blogger and Sugar. And I think I really just liked this name, Blogger. I thought that was really fun. So I got these two lip pencils. And then while these are out, I'll just do these for jewelry. I just got this basic um, beauty supply store pretty much packed up earrings. I feel like I'm always like running around trying to find some studs to put in my ear because I, I don't know if you guys ever noticed, but I never wear hoops or anything. I'm really just like a stud girl. So, um, 
<laughs> so I put these um, in my cart because I was just like, you can literally never have enough studded earrings. I take mine out every night, so I've never ran into the problem of breaking out or anything. So yeah, I got these. And then I just got these basic little necklaces. This one is really long. So I thought that would be cute with like just a plain dress like during the summer or something. And then this one is just like a upside down triangle. And it's just gold and little rhinestones. So I really liked those. Now onto the fun part where I literally went crazy. I'm about to show you guys. All my lippies that I decided to get. It's to the point where I can't even use any of these in a giveaway because I opened them all because I was being so selfish. And I will be doing a lipstick try on from this site. So today I'm just going to be showing them to you guys. So this is a Wonder Metal. And this is in the shade Digital. I loved like the, the names. So I have Digital. And the, the metals are first. Digital Cosmo Aura. It's a really pretty gold. I actually have on Aura right now mixed with Diamond. So I have Aura and Diamond on right now. I actually like the way they feel. They feel really lightweight. Um, but I don't feel them or see them like sliding off. So that's always good. When you don't really feel like too much on your lips, but you know it's still there. So, yeah, those were Aura and Diamond. And then for my last metallic, I have Candy. And it's like a really pretty, like, lilac-y pink. So those are my metallic colors. And then I have this matte in a... It's the brand Amuse, and the color is I don't see the color, but I'll be sure to leave it down in the description box below. Um, and then this is a Wonder Matte, so the same brand as the metallic, and it is in the shade Tease. I really liked this name and this color. And then, of course, you know, a girl has to pick up a nude lip. And this one is called Faded. So, yeah, I got all of those. And I think that's really it. Is that it? I feel like I got so much more, but I guess I didn't. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Let me know if you guys have ever shopped on this site. Or, you know, if you are going to shop on this site. I think it's really, you know good especially if you're just picking up little things like little lippies to wear like earrings stuff like that you're not really wearing every day so you're not killing it so I think that it's great for stuff like that also I told you guys they have headbands and stuff I didn't even I don't know why I'm pointing I didn't get my headband from there but they have headbands they just have everything so I will be sure to leave all my products that I ordered as well as the link to the website. They have a storefront somewhere. I'm going to leave that down below too. Just in case any of my subscribers are near there. I did hear that the store is like super crowded all the time. But I'm not surprised at all. Um, shipping wise. I think it took about six days. Not even a full like you know seven day week. So that was really good. But I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Please do not forget to give it a big thumbs up. Don't forget to comment down below. Let me know what you guys think. And don't forget to subscribe as well as hit that bell so you guys know when I'm releasing a new video. I'll see you guys in the next one. Bye.